Hi, Investor Nation, Tasty Nation, and Crypto Nation. This video is for Canadians only, and I'm going to show you how to trade cryptocurrencies on interactive brokers. So if you're in any other country besides Canada, of course, you would just use Tastyworks, and they've already had cryptocurrencies for quite a while, and they have the best commissions in the whole industry. But if you're in Canada, then you have interactive brokers, which is pretty much the only platform we have for trading options and, and futures. And now Interactive Brokers has just added cryptocurrencies. So I'm gonna show you how to do that right now. Okay, so I'm gonna pop over into my IB platform here and I'm on my favorites list. And down at the bottom here, I have a bunch of cryptocurrencies that I've listed. Now the first one I have here is MBT is actually the micro Bitcoin futures. So this one's a little different from the other ones I have on the list. Just to show you what Bitcoin is trading for right now, it's trading for 47,295 and you can see the chart there. And if I was to buy one contract of the micro Bitcoin future, you can see that the notional value is 4,700. So that's one tenth of a Bitcoin. The commission is almost $5 and the amount of buying power I will use up doing this is $2,900. So there's a little bit of leverage involved there. Even though I'm buying an Ocean product that's worth 4,700, it's only asking me to put up $2,900 in initial margin or buying power. So that's been there for a little while now. But the new thing that just came out today, at least I just noticed it today, is these four cryptocurrencies that you can buy directly in any amount. And these are not futures products. These are the actual cryptocurrencies using what's called Paxos. So there's BTC, which is regular Bitcoin. There's BCH, which is Bitcoin Cash. There's ETH, which is Ethereum. And there's LTC, which is Litecoin. So they've only have four right now. So they're quite a bit behind Tastyworks, but at least they have it. So this is probably our first opportunity in Canada to trade cryptocurrencies directly using our reputable, legitimate brokerage. Okay, so if I click on Ethereum, for example, it's going to plot ETH. And if I go in to buy it, say I put in a bid price and it's asking me to put in the number of minutes I want this order to be valid. And then I have to put in a quantity here. So I can put in the amount in US dollars or the amount in Ethereum coins. So I'm going to go in here and type in 0 0.1 Ethereum, which is 340 US dollars, apply and close and then go over here and check my margin. Now it says I don't have trading permissions yet. So all you have to do is click this button here. You only need to do this the first time you trade cryptocurrencies, request permissions. Okay, since I'm already logged in on my platform, it took me right to the page, request and configure trading permissions. I'm gonna click continue. Okay, so I couldn't figure out how to add permissions to trade the cryptocurrencies. So I'm just gonna call into Interactive Brokers right now and figure out what the heck's going on here. My name is Stefan. Oh, yeah, sorry, I'm in Canada. Okay, yeah, so what has happened over here is that right now, uh, cryptocurrencies are only for U.S. clients. It's only for U.S. residents at this point in time. So whenever we expand, whenever uh, your region comes into or your jurisdiction comes into consideration, uh, we'll let you know. But right now, cryptocurrencies are only for uh, U.S. residents. Oh, really? Okay. Uh, is there any timeline for when you might get them for Canada? Uh, I'm not sure on that. You know, if there is something, then you'll be uh, getting a notification in that regard informing you about it. It's available for uh, Canada, but at this point in time, it's only for U.S. residents. Oh, but wait, how could you not have a timeline for Canada? I'm sorry? How could you not have a timeline for Canada? There's no plan to offer cryptocurrencies to Canadians? No, at this point in time, there isn't any update on that. Oh, that's too bad. Okay, well, thanks anyway. Yeah, if there is anything, you'll get a notification because uh, at this point in time, there's no update. That's it. Only for you. Is there anything else apart from this? No, that's it. Thanks for calling it back to the group. Okay, thanks. Bye bye. So as you heard, they're offering a product, but not offering it to Canadians. I'm so disappointed. There you go. Sorry for putting out this video, getting my hopes up, getting everyone's hopes up, but there are no cryptocurrencies on Interactive Brokers for Canadians. Anyway, thanks for watching everyone. Sorry I didn't have any good news there. I was super excited about this and it didn't work out. But if you haven't seen my video on how to trade crypto strategically, make sure you check that out. And thanks for watching. I will be sure to update everyone as soon as I find out anything about trading crypto in Canada. Thanks for watching.